Hi, Adrian here from Kingston Yacht Sales. Today showcasing my 2003 Regal Commodore 4260. Now before we get started, I just want to remind you that this is a 360 virtual video. So you don't have to look at me the whole time. While I'm talking, you can use uh, your finger, if you're on a smart device, to scroll around the boat and look at some different areas. Or if you're at home on your desktop, use your mouse, grab the screen, and drag it to look at different things as we're giving you this tour. So, 2003 Regal Commodore 4260s. And if you've seen any of my videos, you're going to know I'm a big Regal fan. I love the quality in these boats. I love the way these boats are laid out. Uh, I love the swim platform and I love all the layouts and the construction they've done on these. So they're a high quality boat that shows very well and is a pleasure to drive and of course they're known to be fast. That's Regal's claim to fame in a lot of their big boats is those boats move. So today I'm going to walk you through. First thing I want you to notice is the sea deck that you'll see on the back of this boat. We do have the trunky in here with the power cords, dual power cords that do have the cable masters. You're going to see the installed sea deck all way and the double walk around that takes you into the cockpit to the half moon table. I'm going to carry you through here, so bear with me. Notice the sea deck is throughout. This is a black hulled boat. Um, I'll set you here for one quick second. Take a look in here. We do have our refrigerator under here with our full sink and wet bar up top. The half moon table that Regal's known for. I'm going to bring you up to the helm where I want to show you a few things that make this boat pretty special. And of course, number one we love about this boat is engines. This has the Volvo uh, diesel powered engines with the diesel Kohler generator. So that makes this a very sought after boat in this size range. Notice looking up, full hardtop with the large supports. And this is what I'm talking about, regal quality. I love these large supports. I love the thick frames around the windows and the stainless steel. Well put together. This boat does come equipped with the auto helm. It does have the uh, electronic shifters, so nice and easy to drive. Um, and again, the sea deck throughout with the, uh, with the sun pad up top that tilts up, the electric windlass and the spotlight. Again, the hard top. I love it, makes boating so much more fun. Come on down into the interior, bear with me. And I'll just show you the last few things. Set you here, looking forward. This is a huge dinette area. Um, it's a huge dinette. If you look around, you'll see uh, the large table, huge sitting area, and a big queen walk around berth up front. Main head is in here. It's large. Please take a look at some of the other pictures and the 360 photos that we have. But it is a huge one with a separate shower stall. Behind us, we have the separate cabin. Uh, if you scroll around on your video, you'll be able to see that it does have the two cabins. Uh, it has the uh, second head back here with the vanity sink as well. Full galley to the side here, refrigerator, um, freezer, microwave, panel up top with all your switches, television mounted to the wall, uh, and a, just a ton of counter space. Carrying you back in here, just so you get a good sense of what you can see here. This is a twin bed. It does switch down to two individual twins, or you can have this bed staying as the double with the second head in here and full hanging closets. So taking a look up at the front, I just want to kind of give you the last sense of what this boat is about. And it really is about space and quality of build. The hardwood's been put in this boat, which gives it a nice little touch, no more carpeting in here. With the sea deck up top, it gives it a pretty good look. Um, but everything's shiny. We've got inlaid mirrors up top with the, uh, with the symbols. You know, nice woodwork the whole way through. 